this is Baby Doll Natural One, AKA Mary Denise. I have an Amazon haul um, of all the stuff I've gotten lately. Actually, this tripod that my phone is sitting on now, it's still working pretty fine, but when I slide it up, it eases back down slowly. So I needed another one of those. And then I needed a car tripod, but I bought this other kind. I'm gonna show y'all. I just um, ordered several things, but I'll go ahead and show y'all what I ordered. And so we're gonna get right into the video. You can comment below what you think, subscribe and like this video. Thank you so much. I love you all. Well, I just opened this box, guys. I thought my, my camera was recording. And this is uh, the tripod I was telling y'all about. It. The tripod I have my phone on now, but this one is one that I'll carry in my hand like when I'm out and about and I, um, I'm vlogging. This is the little light that I just opened that you see right here at the top. And it has a little clicker inside of there, if you can see it. But that come with that. And this is the tripod. See how it folds out right here. And it has a little clicker there to take pictures. That's neat. And it also has a thing to turn your phone so you can hold your phone the right way. <laughs> I have a habit of having my phone turned the other way by accident. I was just doing it. And it also extends like this one does that I'm using. And I think it opens at the bottom. See how that works? That's the way my phone is standing right now on this one. But like I said, when I pull it out to extend it from, like if I want it on the floor or extend it taller on the tabletop it kind of slides down and also i ordered me some earbuds i have some earbuds that i use just they're wireless ones i use them when i'm at work and stuff to listen to music they have a little volume button on the on this part right here they have a little volume thing on them and i just needed some little wire well, wired earbuds. So we have another box here to open. Oh, and I ordered this Nivea Cocoa Butter Body Cream. I like my legs and stuff to be really smooth. And I just wanted to try something. And my skin gets pretty dry, but I just wanted something for my skin. Smells pretty good too. Also, I have another car tripod, I guess that's what you call it, for my car. And you can stick it to your window or on your dash. But now, for a minute, it has started falling off. I still put it on there, but then the part that holds my phone, it lets my phone fall out. So that's why I bought another one. But this one hangs over your rear view mirror. The phone is right there in your face, and you can turn the passenger seat or in the um, in the driver's side. You can see how it looks right here. This part hangs behind your mirror, just around the top, the little handle thing that the mirror comes down from. And then your phone goes right in here. I thought this would be something different to try. And it wasn't that much. Mostly everything I bought was like $7.99 or something like that. None of this stuff was expensive at all. And this right here is some tennis screen protectors. No one can see what's on your phone but you because you got to be like within really close range. You can't just see it from standing over you, I don't think. You see how they look. You can barely see it. Think about putting it over the screen protector I have already on there because I don't want to take it off. I want to just lay this one right over top of it. That's what I'm thinking about doing. I don't know if that's going to work or not. But if not, I might just take the other one off. But I just put it on there. Somehow I crack screens easy and it's good I have a screen protector on there because this 
I just got a new phone and I put a new cover on there, a screen protector on there. And I'm glad I had it on there because I've cracked it already and just changed it. Hold on, guys. My phone about to die. Okay, guys, I'm back. I was talking about the screen protector. I got these because I don't like nosy people all up in my phone. And usually I don't have that problem, but just certain places I just rather have a thing over my phone. And it comes two in a pack. It comes with the little yellow packs with the, um, it's called screen protector accessories. It's just a little dry wipe, the little wet wipe, and then a little cloth to wipe your screen off before you add your screen protector. I needed some setting spray. Oh, I have. Yes, this is the Fit Me by Maybelline. This is the primer, the matte plus poreless primer. It's sunscreen in it too. And I have this other little bag that I ordered something and I thought it was a different kind of stand that I could carry around, but it's not. It's like the other little stand. It goes with my ring light that I just got. This one was only like $5 and I didn't realize that it was basically the same on the other stand and it extends a little bit, just a little bit. Cause you don't really need it to stand that far. If you want your uh, stand a little taller, you can uh, stand it up. And this just screws on to the bottom of your, like the that one that I have in there is the ring light. So it screws onto the ring light. I had to screw the stand that came with the ring light onto the little stand like this. It's a little stand like this. And you can also take it off of that and put it on your big stand when you get ready to video or whatever you're gonna do or screw your camera on there. But I think this is too light for a camera. This would be just mainly for the little ring light like I have in the room or, or like if you have another piece where you hook it on to for your phone to sit on. The Nova auto tracking phone holder, but you lay your phone in it and it follows you like around the room. Where, and let me see if I can turn it on and show you. If it's charged up, I don't know. It might not be charged up because I hadn't been using it. I don't know. But anyway, here's the little thing and it turns. You see, it turns like this when it's charged up. I'll have to charge it up and show you. But it turns and it can turn all the way around. It's got a little button. This is the on and off button and it turns all the way around like that. And this is the part that holds your phone, whether you stand it up or have it laying sideways. And this little button tightens it like in there. So it closes in on it and loosens it up. I like this, I've used it. I hadn't used it really to record videos. Most of the time I hadn't really thought about it, but yeah, I like this and I have to try to use it, but I gotta charge it up. I had it charged just to see how it works because if something's not working for me, I'll send it back. But yeah, I really like this. And I'm gonna link everything in the description down below so you will know where I got it from. Well, I got everything off of Amazon. This is an Amazon haul, but you will know the price and everything. And of course, most of the time you can find stuff cheaper than might be or it might have been the cheapest price they had but anyway this is the little auto tracking phone holder and this is what the box looks like I'm outside in it. and it just have other stuff that it all that it does and stuff like that on the back i don't see and that's a picture of it holding the phone sideways Vlog shooting, live screaming, real time chat, or record life robot. Or I call it a robot because that's basically what it seemed like to me when it's working. But anyway, that's that. And I wanted to show y'all this is a gift Michael had got me. You heard me talking about it. And it because I seen the movie Emily in Paris. And I looked it up on Amazon when I saw the movie. I looked it up right then and they had it. And this is the one that they had. Emily in Paris 
and it's for my iPhone 13 Pro Max. The buttons don't work, of course. It's just the look. It makes it look like you have a camera around your neck. It comes with the little screen, the little scrap. The little shoulder thing. But yes, it's cute. He asked me where it was recently. I think he got an attitude because he ain't seen me carrying it. But I think it's more like when you're going somewhere, you want to have it hanging around your neck, not just for everyday use because I can't put it in my... You know, my stand on my uh, car, the little, my dash um, stand, I have to keep taking it on and off. So I want to use it when I'm somewhere out and about and I just want to carry it around my neck. I'll use it for that. But I just thought I'd let y'all see that. I, but it ain't nothing you're going to carry all the time. We have this Gear Beast. Uh, it's just this little thing right here. It goes around your neck. It's like, I got it for my phone. Like, you could put the corners of your phone in there and it should stay in there. And then if you don't have it around your neck, you can carry it in your hand and put that on your finger to hold your phone. But it's like a real soft, rubbery feel. And I just bought that. I'm going to see how it works with my phone. Then I bought another little case because it comes with a, a tempered glass that's inside of here. I got this case. I don't know how I'm going to like this case or if I'm going to like it or not, but it comes apart like this. And it has that little thing in there. But we'll see. I might be sending that back. I don't know. I don't really like the color. The color is fine. I just don't like the... I don't know. It might be all right. I'm not sure. But anyway... I just really need the tempered glass and it came with it. So I went ahead and got that out. Then I have the shower caddy. I have, I bought a set and I put now, it's like with my shampoo and my body washes and stuff, I need a second shelf. So I bought these for mine and, I, and it comes with a little soap thing. And the ones I got, we got in our bathroom are black too, but I don't think they're exactly shaped like these. So I'm gonna just take the other one out of my shower and put it in his bathroom and put these two up in my shower with the little soap caddy. But yeah, I like these. I like these better than those other plastic ones that you use to screw the little suction thing to the wall. Those things fall down and break. We had a, some of those and I did not like them at all. So I ordered this little uh, LED selfie ring light and I don't know if it's bigger than the one I already have but I think my end on my other one like this is broken so that's one reason I need another one and so this one can I think can screw on the on the one I have the stand that I have to the other one or I can use it as a stand to go on the table because it comes with a little stand um clicker thing to take pictures and things like that. I have like three of these already. And it comes with this to hold your cell phone. This attaches to that and you hold your phone inside of it, inside the ring light, I believe. And it comes with a little stand, a three-legged stand that screws on to the uh, light, but see it has the little screw thing right there where you can screw it on. So it stands on the table also. And it also has this other little piece that you can screw onto there to make it stand taller or just depending how you want to put it on. Oh, and it also comes with this other little phone um, thing that you can put the phone on. This stuff out of the way. These are the earbuds I was telling you about, and they're the wireless earbuds. They work really, really well. They work just as good as, I figure, 
I don't know. I can't say as an iPhone or earbuds because uh, I've heard used those before, but I don't remember exactly how they work because they weren't mine. But they work really good. They they get really really loud, and I usually use one at a time because most time I might be at work listening to music or something like that. But I keep one earbud out so I can hear my phone ring in case I get a phone call or something while I'm doing my orders. But yeah, I like these, and like I said, I bought these. And then I bought a wired pair that, but they plug into your iPhone, so I can't really use those with my um, with my computer. So I have to keep up with these because I usually use these when I'm editing my videos. They're by Tazo. I guess that's Tazo. I, mm. And this is what they look like on the inside. And they also, this is the, the little four dots right there. They light up when you're charging it. And then when they're, I guess they go off. They light up all four lights when they're completely charged, I think. And so, this is what they look like. The little case. This is with them open. And that's how they look. And that's the, just the inscription on the inside. And I just needed some um, shampoo and conditioner. And I just went ahead and ordered some online because I needed some, it's some argan oil shampoo and conditioner that I bought, that I found online. And I have another box. Oh, and I bought a three pack of the Dove body wash and I thought it was the big ones, but I guess not. not they're, um, actually this size they're not a bad size but it probably comes up to about the same amount as the tall regular ones i'm not sure i would have to look at my shower and see what those uh ounces are with like 15 dollars for three and so but that's the uh pomegranate lemon vingry vintage something and then i have the um this one kind of open, it got it on everything. So I'm gonna be letting them know. But this one is the uh, cucumber and green tea. This one smells good. I have this one already in the shower and uh, a smaller bottle or the regular bottles. And then I have the regular one. I, nice size bottles there. I guess they're basically the same as the, um, I'm gonna look at the ounces on the other one and see what th those are, but still, like I, I said, that's a good deal because even if they were like $5 a piece, that's still a good deal because usually you can pay, it's usually five something or six something for the regular bottles. And that's probably about the same size as those. I'm not sure, but I like those. I like having them in my shower. I love shower gel. I like it better than using soap, but I do use the Dove soap sometimes for my face. I don't even know if I had it started. It's an everyday product for your hair. I bought it like to put on my wig or something, especially when I have curly wigs. And I just wanted to try this because I've used some of their products. This is the Curly Curls Construct Creation Mousse. So hopefully it don't make it all crunchy and hard or whatever because I don't really care for all that. I don't know, this can is shiny. It was just something I ordered for my hair because I didn't find nothing in the store that I wanted to use or whatever. I was looking for the Cantu. I saw some Cantu mousse, but I was in Walgreens and I didn't feel like going to Walmart. So I didn't go and look for nothing. I, I had several things coming, but I, I think, I don't know if all of them came today. I might have one more thing that's coming later. So everything might've came except for one other thing that was supposed to come. 
so oh I don't know. Okay, this is some hair I bought. And it comes with a little needle I see. This is a crochet hair that I ordered because I wanted to do my hair, but since I did it like this, I might leave this to the end of the week, depending how it holds up. But um I don't know. If I decide to do it, I'm a, uh, I might put this hair in. This is some, see, I don't even think it has a picture. That's why I hate buying certain hair, you know, on Amazon and it don't have a stuff with it. And I hope it's enough. Well, it is, I think, cause I was gonna, what my plan was to pull it apart. Cause I saw a couple YouTubers that mostly have hair videos. They did a hairstyle with this hair and I think this is the wand curls. Well, I was looking at the wand curls and the, um, well, similar, similar to wand curls. So, oh, flex rod curls. They were flex rod curls and these wand curls look similar to the flex rod curls. Like, especially when you untwist them, like when people do their hair and untwist. This is how the flexi rod would usually look when you untwist them, I, that's what this may look like too. I don't know how much I'm gonna like it. Hopefully I like it pretty good because I just want a nice little hairdo that I don't really have to do anything to and I can just put my cap on. But anyway, that's one of the things I bought. And then I bought a wig, a headband wig. Let's see. The only thing I hate about sometimes buying hair on Amazon or wigs on Amazon like they don't come in the packaging like you would. Like I like the pretty packaging like when it comes with the headband, but I already have this headband that came with a Love Me wig. I have the same hairband. I was hoping this was the hairband they showed on the video or on Amazon with the wig, but I was hoping that they would send me a different color, but it looked like they did. And I hope that if it is, it's not made exactly like that, but I don't guess it matter because it's not made exactly like it, it's just a straight one. The other one I have from Love Me is like the crisscross one, but it's still the same. But I don't know. But uh, I thought this weed was, I thought it was black with a little brown in the front, but I guess it's a dark brown with the, what do you call this? Like a, it's not brunette, it's like a honey blonde color in the front, but it's a bob wig. And I wanted to try something different. I love my hair black. Ooh, it's thick. You can see how it falls. I like that. I like the way it falls, the way it's cut. And I like how thick it feels. But I wanted to try something different than my regular black hair. But yeah, I like this. I need to get me some wig heads so I can put them in my closet and put all my wigs on because when I don't have them where I'm wearing them or anything, I end up putting them back in the bags and sticking them in the closet. I like this. I can't wait to wear it. And I'll link everything down below. Put this haul all on one video because I hadn't did it. And I think I found a way to link this, the uh, things that I got but I like the way the little ends of them made because it's easy to part and it makes your parts look really crisp. That's how they had them. They were only like five or $6 and they got the little metal ends. But I bought these because I needed more than one because sometimes I can't find my other one. I just wanted to have a few of them put up. But yeah, that's all I got. Uh, I think that's all I ordered anyway. I needed some rubber bands and I totally forgot about them. I just wanted to come on here and share these items with you. And I'm gonna put this stuff up so I can finish editing these videos. I'll talk to y'all later. Have a great day. Love y'all. Bye-bye.